The Central Air Service started in 1978 as part of airline deregulation. It's still here 35 years later, and many in Congress would like to see it go. In 1997, a Central Air Service was serving 95 cities at a cost to taxpayers of $26 million. Today, it's ballooned to 117 cities at a cost of nearly $222 million. It's had lawmakers asking whether it's worth the money. This is about the easiest choice that the House could possibly make to put an end to the so-called essential air service that lavishly subsidizes some of the least essential air services in the country. Decatur's essential air service gets over 2.6 million a year in taxpayer subsidies to operate Air Choice One. Nine seat Cessna caravans serving Chicago and St. Louis. St. Louis and Chicago are pretty much ideal for this community. Airport director Joe Atwood defends the subsidy to keep flights landing here in Decatur. The subsidy is key to the service. Without the subsidy, there wouldn't be the service. And the service is uh, obviously important to the community in that it is the way to get into the national air transportation system. Passengers pay $44 a ticket to fly from Decatur to O'Hare in Chicago, plus 10 bucks in fees. Taxpayers kick in another $90 in subsidies for every seat on the plane, even if they're empty. Still, the Illinois congressional delegation says essential air service is needed. They're true economic engines for this area and for their communities, and we need to make sure that passengers come first when it comes to air service. Decatur continues to benefit even though Bloomington, Champaign, and Springfield all have airports with jet service within a one-hour drive. What would you say to other members of Congress or citizens that would say it's a waste of money? Well, I disagree. I think when you look at these local airports, you look at the essential air service that, that passengers provide, you know, it's an opportunity to grow our local economies. It's an opportunity to create jobs that politicians keep talking about. While many essential air service airports struggle to fill seats, Decatur is slowly increasing its passenger usage. Our numbers have improved quite dramatically from inception to today to nearly 10,000 passengers a year. As Congress looks to cut more money, essential air service will remain in the budget cutting crosshairs. For the I-Team, I'm Doug Wolf, WAND News.